Hello Tiger fans, Emily Dixon joined with head coach Brian Kelly at the, after the Tigers just scrimmaged Saturday afternoon in Tiger Stadium. Coach Kelly, 14 fall camp practices in the books. Where have you seen some of the biggest strides with your team across the month of August? Probably, um, you know, in all areas, but particularly maybe the offensive line coming together. Um, you know, I think some continuity there was really important. Um, probably the wide receivers, you know, as a group you know, can continue to make plays for us, which we thought, you know, coming in. I think uh, also, you know, knowing that we have a really good rotation in the back end of our defense with the corners and safety. So, you know, you, you see those things coming together. Uh, we knew about our defensive line. Um, and then, you know, the quarterback situation, you know, with, um, you know, two quarterbacks really. I think Walker has, has done a nice job, but I think he, you know, he's probably, you know, in a position to be redshirted this year. Um, and, you know, Nussmeyer and, and Daniels are, you know, vying for that starting position. So I think it's starting to come together. Yeah, so we talked a little bit last week about the quarterbacks, and now the makeup of that room has shifted with the departure of Miles Brennan. So like you just said, with Jane Daniels and Garrett Nussmeyer taking the majority of reps, how is that competition coming along now as we get closer to kickoff? Well, they're both really good football players. They both make plays. Um, you know, you're really splitting hairs, I think, um, you know, in terms of deciding who's the starter. Uh, both are capable, but we got to make a decision, and we'll probably make that, you know, pretty soon here um, because we want to get some continuity within the offensive structure. But both of them have had really good camps. Um, it's, a, it's hotly contested, and look, it wouldn't surprise me if both ended up playing this year you know, and contributing to success, no doubt. Well, with each practice, you're getting more and more familiar with your roster and the group of guys on this team. Can you circle anybody as some standouts that you have seen have really progressed through fall camp? Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, first of all, I think some of the freshmen um, have been really impressive. If you look at, um, you know, just across the board, um, you know, uh, Jalen Davis uh, Robinson, you know, a corner that has come in and really found himself on the travel roster. Uh, I think he's going to be a guy that, that's going to play a lot for us. Uh, Harold Perkins is another guy from a defensive standpoint that's going to play a lot of football for us. We already know about Will Campbell, yes. another freshman. Uh, Emory Jones, you know, there's four freshmen right there. They're going to compete and be in the two deep. So I just think, you know, LT, uh, the Terrence Welch is going to be a guy that's going to probably make the travel and roster. So when I really think about it, there's probably six, maybe seven of those freshmen um, that get a chance now to um, compete and be in the two deep. I think that's a lot for an SEC roster, uh, but they're all really good players. Okay, lastly, I know you have a laundry list of to-do things that you want to get done before kickoff, but what are some of the major points of emphasis that you want to get through with these next couple weeks of practice in August before Florida State? Well, I think solidifying, you know, the, the running back situation, you know, that's been a committee. Um, you know, I saw today Noah Kane ran the ball very well. You know, um, you know, we know that we've got some, some backs there that can be very effective. Touching the ball out of the backfield as well, but that guy that has to be there on third down, picking up blitzes, mm -hmm. that, that's got to clean itself up. We've got to find out who that guy is. So, so the running back position, tight end, you know, we're playing a Mason Taylor. Here's another freshman sure. who's going to come in and compete for us. We want to clean up that position a little bit. So, you know, I think that uh, as well as, you know, the kicking game, you know, um, uh, is one that we, you know, we're in a battle right now. Um, you know, Ramos has uh, done a nice job for us, uh, come in as a walk-on in camp, uh, and has really solidified himself there. Those are the things we want to clean up as we move forward. Awesome. Well, looking forward to it. Only two weeks until kickoff, and Coach Kelly, just remember, it never rains in Tigers. Yeah, I, I, I got a sense there's some guys waiting so they don't interrupt the, the interview. They're soaking wet. They're already soaked, though. They're, they're, they're already wet. It's good. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Yeah.